A former inmate tells us women in state prisons only get 12 pads a month. But a new bill would make feminine hygiene products unlimited. Nobody should be humiliated and have to bleed in public. Sue Ellen Allen says she was released from Perryville Prison in 2009 after serving seven years for securities fraud. She says she saw this issue play out all the time. If you need more, you can ask for t up to 12 more, say 24 at a time. But if the officer is in a bad mood, they could just humiliate you. Allen says women knew they could go to her for extra. They know where they can get pads because they have to, to if they have a heavy flow or if you know it's a bad month for them, they have to know where to go. So for the committee, uh, it was all men, and I think they learned a lot listening to the testimony. Representative Athena Solomon is sponsoring House Bill 2222, which would appropriate $80,000 a year to give female inmates an unlimited supply of free feminine hygiene products. About 15 other states right now currently provide free tampons. And the Federal Bureau of Prisons made a similar move last summer. Solomon says this bill is now stalled in the Rules Committee. Is it human rights to be able to take care of yourself? I think it is. The Department of Correction says they're looking at their current policy and they say they believe these concerns can be handled administratively and not through the legislature. In Phoenix, Lindsay Riser for Arizona's Family.